Have you heard the incredible story of Angry Birds? It's a tale of creativity, perseverance, and explosive success. Rovio Entertainment, the brilliant minds behind the game, crafted an addictive gameplay experience that quickly became a global phenomenon. Let's talk about how Rovio Entertainment made Angry Birds, which quickly became a global phenomenon. Before jumping directly onto the story of Angry Birds Company, let's have a look at the developer behind it. Who was it? Rovio Entertainment was founded in 2003 by three Finnish students, Nicholas Head, Jarno Vakavainen, and Kim Dykert. The company started as a mobile game development studio called Relude. However, after several years of struggling to find success, the founders decided to change their approach and focus on creating games that were simpler, more accessible, and more fun. They say, we craft joy. And see one of their products is Angry Birds, which is the true depiction of what they claim. Let's now talk about Angry Birds. The primary setting of the Angry Birds series is Earth, a made-up version of the planet with the same name. The original background for the franchise is set on the fictitious island of Piggy, where the Angry Birds, a group of unique birds, guard three eggs. Red, the Angry Birds de facto leader, and the other Angry Birds take their task extremely seriously since they believe that when the eggs hatch, it will bring peace to the island. Nevertheless, because of the antiquated rules requiring all kings to consume eggs at least once throughout their lifetime, the Piggy Kingdom, a political group made up of pigs, frequently steals their eggs in order to feed King Pig smooth cheeks. The Angry Birds use a slingshot to fling themselves and damage the pig's structures in order to get their eggs back. To see what actually happened, let's travel back to 2009. The employees of the bankrupt Rovio Entertainment Corporation started looking through concepts for prospective games in early 2009. Senior game designer Yako E. Salo made one such suggestion in the shape of a mock-up screenshot named Birds that showed some angry-looking birds without legs or wings. The crew loved the characters, so the group decided to create a game around them despite the fact that the image left no indication of the sort of game that was being played. The Rovio team was inspired by physics games that were popular flash-based web games in the early part of 2009, such as Smash the Castle. The team working on Angry Birds felt the birds required a foe while the game was being created. The team changed the adversaries of the birds to be pigs because the swine flu pandemic was now making headlines. Angry Birds was the 52nd game the company has created, although it didn't sell a lot of copies when it first came out. In February 2010, Angry Birds was a featured app on the UK App Store, where it swiftly rose to the top. In the middle of 2010, it did the same on the paid applications ranking in the US App Store, where it remained for 275 days. Without accounting for expenditures for later upgrades, it was believed that the initial development cost of Angry Birds exceeded 100,000 euros. 113,724.90 Rovio collaborated with distributor Chilingo to distribute the game on the App Store for the iOS version. Rovio self-published later ports of the game, with the exception of the PSP version, which was produced under license by Abstraction Games. Rovio Entertainment settled on a minimum set of requirements for the Android version, even though it left 30 types of Android phones unable to run the game. The company faced challenges on the way to success of the game. Rovio developed Angry Birds for Facebook in 2010, understanding the challenges of transplanting a game concept between social platforms and mobile gaming systems. The Facebook version incorporates social gaming concepts and in-game purchases and was released in February 2012. Angry Birds has been improved with the ability to synchronize progress across multiple devices, as well as new games such as Seasons, Space, Star Wars, Go, and Epic. A sequel, Angry Birds Under Pigstruction, was also released. Rovio's success with Angry Birds allowed the company to expand into other areas, including merchandising, movies, and television shows. Today, Rovio Entertainment is a leading entertainment company with a global presence and a portfolio of popular games and franchises. Are you ready to watch more epic tales of top games like Angry Birds? Let us know in the comments and keep the excitement going. Don't forget to hit that like and share button if you're feeling inspired by the fascinating facts about Angry Birds.